What's up, guys? It is Jack and Adam from AchievementHunter.com, back in Star Wars The Old Republic. Adam, what are we doing today? This is the uh, the Red Reaper Flashpoint, level Ooh. 45. That sounds like like a story parents tell their kids to like make them not go out at night or something. Uh, it, it'd be close. <laughs> there's, a, there's a big, mean Darth guy, and we got to go kill him. Oh, sweet. Okay. Yeah. So you think kids should go out and kill the big, mean Darth guy? Yeah, is that what you're trying to definitely. say? Definitely. So parents would not be happy to hear that. All no. right, so this is a uh, this looks like a higher flashpoint. What is this one at? It's a level 45 flashpoint. Uh, this one is actually kind of follows uh, some of the earlier flashpoints where there's a lot of there's a lot of trash mobs you have to fight through. Okay. So you you start off and you've probably got 15 20 minutes of of trash before getting to the first boss, which Lord is Lord Karras. Lord Karras. Um, he's a typical Sith Marauder, dual wielding lightsabers. Uh -huh. uh, Mace Windu, purple style. <laughs> uh, now, uh, the hostages, so it looks like you cannot hurt those hostages. You though. cannot hurt the hostages. However, he will soul drain the hostages, which will c recover HP for him. Ah. You have to interrupt him, and then he will run to one of his sides and then start throwing like boxes uh -huh. at, at your players, which do spike damage, so your healers kind of have to... Keep an eye out for Yeah, keep stuff. an eye out for, for spiking HP. Other than that, it's a reasonably simple fight. Uh, just you know, interrupt him when he starts doing soul drain, okay. and uh, watch out for spike HP. Okay, so you're you're pretty much you're, this is the healer's point of view. We should say this is, again. yeah, this is the healing point of view. Okay, um, AOE attack. Yep. God, I love me some AOEs. Bounty hunters some, have some awesome AOEs. Yes, they do. Man, I ran I ran healing for the first time the other day, and I had a lot of fun doing it. Actually, it kind of makes really? me want to do it. That's surprising some for someone more. who is giving me crap five flash points ago. I know for healing. Up. Okay, yeah. anyway, so this is a slicing uh, shortcut. Okay. If you have slicing, I, I believe like three twenty five. So they just nerf slicing too. So I yeah, think they did. People are kind of upset by that. Yeah, Man, still profitable, but not nearly as much as no, it was before. No, not ridiculous like it was no. before. So more trash All on right. the next on the way to the next boss. Next boss is right here. You'll Ooh. see these six crystals. This okay. is the SV three Eradicator droid. Nice. Um, and you see the, the the six crystals. They have two colors, red okay. and blue. He has two lasers, a red and a blue laser. Okay. The more crystals that match the color the harder the laser hits. Now, you can get really unlucky here. And oh, Jesus. see, they all just changed to blue. Uh -huh. So everyone's clicking their crystals to at least get them to a 50-50 ratio where it doesn't do that much damage. Okay. Now, they, it's about to change, and it's about to change. Oh, there's God. red, and there's the hit. So it was like a millisecond before. So we got really unlucky, and, and our tank landed up dropping. Oh, so you have to watch out for that because you'll you'll see them kind of glow the other color right before they're about to change. Okay. And if they're about to change to the color that he's casting right now, uh -huh. you should make sure you're switching the other ones. Yeah. Um, luckily, he doesn't do that much damage, even as long as you're on top of the crystals, even to non-tank types. Okay. So if you're making sure, like we lost our tank there, but because. You know, we were we were on top of our crystals from that point forward. We were all right. We were able to drop him. Okay. So this is the first um, kind of conversation. You there are a bunch of Sith uh, in here that you get the choice of destroying all the tubes, which is the dark side option. Of course, or you can what you're supposed to do. Yeah, or you can uh, <laughs> release them, which is the neutral option, or the you can just leave them alone, leave them in captivity, which is the light side. So option. Leave them trapped forever. That's the light side. Yeah, okay, we we went for sense. destroy. Nice. Boom. There, you go. there we go. There we go. They're are. all dead. A lot less work. Yep. All right. So uh, moving on here. Moving on. This is the uh, the that's uh, a holocron, right? Archaeology no, uh, shortcut. Okay. So high archaeology. I think three hundred uh -huh. will get you through this next area. If if you don't have high archaeology, you just it's the same thing. It's just a lot more mobs, a lot more trash you got to fight through. Yeah, just kind of work your way through it. Yep. Nothing, Lots more trash. Nothing too crazy difficult, just a lot more work. Just kind yep, of pain. A lot more trash. But if you're going for XP, you know, it doesn't hurt. Yep. You know, get, some, get some extra loot and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. This uh, is the final boss. Okay. Uh, he actually just got retuned, uh -huh. so that's actually why this video is delayed a little bit. I've, I've recorded this one like was, four times now. Man, I was so, I was so um, upset that it took so long <laughs> to do this. Oh, yeah. someone whapped him with a sword. <laughs> someone yeah. chucked a lightsaber Th throw, his head. Lightsaber throw. Hey, what? Ow. So he fun. just got retuned, so now he actually has all of his skills at his disposal, which we'll show here in a minute, which okay. is very different than what it some, was. I see some portals around the room. Yeah. Okay, he woke so his chosen Sith. He just called his little buddies there, and you uh -oh. can see him running in from the side, and they have force fields. Now, Fantastic. he is now invincible until, and, and his buddies have force bond, okay. which means you have to interrupt them to so they lower their shield. Ah. And then you have to drag the boss's force lightning to him. So you see the force lightning is being dragged to him right now, yeah, and yeah. it's about to switch to me, which means I have to now drag 
Force Lightning, which is being cast on me to the enemy, okay. who we are interrupting so he can't cast his shield. So After a couple seconds of being in the middle of Force Lightning, that ad will die. Ah. And that's how you have to kill those ads. You have to do that every single time so they you, spawn. So you can't actually just drop them? You have no. To, you have to drag they, Lightning They have them. something like 3 million literal HP. That's not a joke like last time. They Jeez. actually have that much HP. All right, Later knowledge. in the fight, he gets Ancient Knowledge, which uh, doubles his damage. Uh-huh. Um, however, there will be little fireballs around the room that if you run and grab will reduce your damage by 50%. So if you're taking too much damage, yeah. just grab some of those and it'll be fine. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, but that's pretty much it. You just need to make sure that you have to... Dr- like the force... The fo- the moving the force lightning thing was a, a neat mechanic I had not seen before. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, and it, t- it actually took us several pulls to figure it out. Should we cross the streams? That uh, I doesn't do anything. Sorry. Uh, well, I mean... <laughs> fuck. <laughs> 